Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make yourself um a Minecraft Classic server using McLaw. To me, this is one of the best ones. I'm gonna show you without my SQL, and then I might do a tutorial depending on the amount of views I get for this one with SQL. So why don't we get started? So first, what you want to do is open up your browser. I already have done this. Then you want to type in mclaw.tk and you should come up to this. So, to not really a website that it looks like, but anyways. So you're gonna see this page, then you're gonna hit download right over there. So you're gonna download it. Sure enough, just wait. Now also, before you do this, like, I'm just gonna download it first. Oh crap. So say, um, I'm gonna put make a folder on my desktop and I'm just gonna name it YouTube I guess and then I'm gonna go like this you need to have WinRAR by the way and it's gonna go in there okay so that's the McLaw part is done for what but what you have to do now so say um well not to say so if I'm not sure your computer may be different but type in run on this and hit enter well and I already have it there and then type C CMD okay and I'll come up with this now type IP config enter okay so yours may be different but it should what you're looking for is your default gateway mine's 192.168.2.1 so what you're gonna do now is you're gonna go to your browser type whatever yours is in there um, 168.2.1 now my your internet may be different depending on your internet box if you have the same one as mine then it's gonna be easier so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to application support could be port forward or could be, oh, maybe different mine you're gonna hit enable application support then basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna select the computer up there mine's the game box um now it's gonna reload it so now for mine add new user defined application so name it whatever you want I'm not gonna actually do this but just gonna name Minecraft protocol TCP port range two five five six five to two five five six five and hit add definition and now that's done so now what you're gonna want to do is you want to close out of all this you're gonna open up your McLaw folder go to properties I recommend doing this first hit settings scroll down your name for your server I'm just gonna keep it like that max players and crap right so so far so good um just gonna go down for this anti tunnels depends on your preference I'm gonna do false like this isn't gonna be my server I already have mine um And then like so SQL I already hit, I'm gonna just put false because we're not gonna be I'm not gonna be showing you guys how to do it. So now I'm gonna hit exit save and that's good for now. Now start up McLaw. So should do it should go to a command prompt and then it should come up with something like this. That's good. So it's gonna be creating ranks still good so it's creating us ranks what's now just wait I would I recommend changing your name because it's gonna be hard for Pete like your server name because it's gonna be hard for people to find your server um so yeah mine's just loading up here what you're going to want to do after is properties. Say you want to set yourself as rank. You're going to go to command in here. 
rank your name super just type admin after your name um so yeah basically you're gonna need to set up a backup just do like I'm forget what I did before but um yeah so commands this is where you ch would change everything like the commands that people can use and the blocks this is where you could change some blocks that people can use um so yeah and uh, that's basically it once you've done this port forwarded it and everything your server it should be able to run use you be you be able to go on it and I might make another video to how to be a good admin slash owner of a server because I am quite a good owner I I would think so this has been on me play um and I hope you enjoy this video I hope it helps a lot of you who are stuck on how to make a minecraft classic server so see you next in the next video guys